Hello ladies and gentlemen, we're going to talk about The Purge 2013, so strap yourself in and grab some popcorn, it's going to be a damn good show. The Purge 2013, this film stars Ethan Hawke who appeared in Sinister 2012 and other numerous horror films and 90s films. And this film is one fucking crazy film. Because when I first watched the trailer back in 2013, let's say when I was 12 years old, once I saw the trailer, um, I forgot what movie I was watching, but once I saw the trailer in, in the theaters, I was like, you know what? This looks very interesting. This looks like a great concept. But of course, um, once I watched the movie finally, it wasn't... The film gives you a little backstory that... Um, one night every year for 12 continuous hours, all crime is legal. You can do whatever you want. You can rob a bank, you can kill someone. All that is legal for 12 hours. So it starts at 7 at night and it ends the next morning, or 7 in the morning, the next day. the film revolves around a stupid family making dumb decisions um, Ethan Hawke plays a husband and the father he has two kids and a wife of course and he is a founder of building um, security systems that are 99% efficient but of course when a stranger is getting chased by intruders the dumbest son in the family or the youngest son in the family lets the stranger in the house their own home while intruders are outside looking for the stranger and of course the intruders start threatening the family so basically this film is low-key the strangers because once i saw this trailer back in the day for the for this movie i was like you know what this looks like an interesting good concept i wonder how they're gonna execute it i wonder if it's gonna be outside nope we're not gonna get any outside um chaos till the sequels but this movie was literally like like a home invasion movie such as the strangers strangers uh pray at night and you're next is it a bad horror movie no but it does have some flaws it does kind of start slow but once the um the action or the terror starts uh, roaming in then that's when the movie picks up i just need you to get someone safe does anybody hear me put a lot of good uh, films recently like Halloween, Get Out, they even made successful franchises such as the Paranormal Activity series, the Insidious series, and of course the Sinister movie. So yeah, Purge is definitely one of their um, successes of course. The acting is well done, the, uh, the shots, how the film is developed, the concept, all of that's good. I think, I feel like it's just poorly executed. And as, after this movie came out, it just became a cult following it just became so popular like everybody was talking about the purge when it came out even everyone at uh, high school middle schools college doesn't even matter work everybody was talking about this film they can't get in here right they can't get into our home if you want a real purge movie i probably won't recommend this film it's a good start but it's not it's just not greatly executed yet but for a horror fan yes I do recommend it but for if you guys just want to watch a good purge movie then I probably don't recommend this film just skip this movie if you want because each movie is a different story anyways and I will rate this film honestly I would rate this film a 6 out of 10 it's okay nothing too special that's just my honest opinion so thank you guys for watching, please leave a like and a comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next review.